Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at Ghent University's website. They have an article from Grass to Grassoline. Now, this is in its very preliminary stages, very early stages, but they have found a way to make a very efficient conversion from grass to fuel. They do it by pre-treating the grass with bacteria, and then they uh, break it down into a lactic acid, which they can then use to make plastics or biofuels. It seems like a pretty encouraging study. There's not a whole lot of information there. I'm going to link to this article in the description, and if you have questions, you can contact the professors in this study. But I am a big believer in using grasses, switch grasses, or other plants that grow on the marginal lands around the world to create energy with it. So what you can do is take any plants you have right now, put them in a sealed container, and then they'll break down on their own, producing methane. You can take that methane, and burn it. You can also clean it up and uh, so it doesn't stink like, you know, methane stinks pretty bad. But it, I remember one farmer who uh, just took wood chips, broke them down for over a year, producing methane, put it through a fish tank, through an air bubbler to just get some of the stink out, and then used it to power a generator to run electricity for his home. The heat generated from the breaking down of the wood or grasses, what he used to heat his home and for hot water by running a hose, or a pipe rather, through the sealed container. But he also used the methane to power his car with. Uh, he had a diesel truck, and diesel can burn almost anything that's flammable. So there's lots of methods for turning grasses into an energy source. But this one could be beneficial, however it seems like it could be also somewhat energy intensive through the conversion process, but maybe they recycle some of that breakdown, because it's going to create heat during the breakdown process. Maybe you can utilize that heat for many reasons. I'm sure it creates methane in the breakdown process too. Reuse that for something, maybe to run a power plant that powers the facility that turns this grass into so-called grassoline. Well, I'm going to be following these people. Hopefully they get a commercially viable product in a couple of years. Of course, the link is in the description. If you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.